All right, so here we are in Phuket Town. We do a little walking tour here. Head out into the city. We're on Phuket Road, right next to Phang Naga or Phang Na, as they say here. Go straight across the road. So, Old Town Phuket, known for the Portuguese and Chinese influence. Of course, this is Thailand, so the third. And most important part of it is Thai. Nice hats. Very nice hats. Hello. Good. I like. Maybe later, okay? It is a Saturday night. Shaping up to be a doozy. We are. Oh my god. Uh oh. What just happened? They need uh, traffic signs here. Traffic lights. Yeah, that's that's the downside. Is the there's no walk signs. It's just an accident waiting to happen. All these people in cars. So what do you think? Who was at fault with that uh, road crossing there? I feel like the uh, man had no idea until his wife basically slapped him upside the head, which further enraged him. Just kind of loop around here. They do have a uh, night market going tonight and tomorrow. Now this road, 
I remember this. Okay. You get the idea. Fake flowers. On a, on a building. Can make a building famous. And photogenic. Add a couple rainbow flags in there and you got color. <laughs> I just go with the flow, you know? I dress like an American. Speak English. Eat Thai food. Drink beer. What else can I do? Walk around. Swim in the ocean. King Lee. Oh, they have Kim's massage right there. That's actually a good massage spot. Apparently, I'm running out of battery here. I think somebody got those uh, cups on the back. It sucks the, uh, I don't know what it does. When they put the suck, suction cups on the back. Maybe it sucks out all the back acne. Alright, now for the dubious task of trying to cross the road in Phuket Town. Not the easiest thing in the world to do, but I think we can do it here. Everyone always looks to see where the sign is. And the answer is there is none. I actually just got a nail cut. My nails cut. Oh, another Kim's massage. So there's lots of Kim's massages here. I usually go to the Kim's massage in Patong, but that's the third Kim's massage I've seen. They got really comfortable chairs. That's what I like about them. And the AC always is cranking. Apparently I'm on the wrong side of the road here. Look at this. What is going on with this building? The hotel I'm staying at is the uh, Courtyard by Marriott. I think this is actually the road that we started on in the other direction. So I'm going to go across here. We'll just kind of walk through here, down towards that little teddy bear. So I've basically done a full block by the time I get done. But you can see there's more to it than just this block that 
that I've walked. Oh wow, what is this? It's like seafood. Two cob cow. Two cob cow. Not sure if you guys know this or not, but southern Thailand is different than northern Thailand. And the middle of Thailand is different than both of those. The middle of Thailand is closer to the northern Thailand culture. Southern Thailand culture, the further south you get, the more they're like Malaysia, of course. But from what I understood from some of the locals is they're trying to, I don't know separate or something I don't know I've never really been to the southern part there's like three provinces down there I don't think Satun is one of those that is trying to do that. Satun being where Kolipe is. Now Kolipe being right next to where Langkawi is, Malaysia. This year's uh what do they call it, um, rainy season, has not been anything compared to what it was last year. So it's been a very relaxed rainy season. Here it is, uh, middle of June. This time last year, it was raining every day. But here we've just been getting sunshine every day. A little bit of rain, occasional, but nothing, no torrential rain yet. By this time last year, they'd already had some landslides and stuff like that. As you can see, we are uh, coming back up onto the teddy bear. Where we began. They have a Mexican restaurant, Tequila and Mezcal Bar. Yeah, I got my nails trimmed. Call it a manicure pedicure combo for 500 baht. My nails were getting long, longer than I like. They're not very long, but longer than I like. I was waiting to see if I could find someone who could cut them. Sure enough, I did. And I hooked it up real nice. Okay, <laughs> huh? All right. So there's the big bear. Right here. And that's about all she wrote from Phuket Town here. Oh. Let's see if I can get across the road. See you guys on the next one from Phuket.